Getting out there, the Packers getting ready to go. These guys had to punt their last possession, and that's become too familiar of a refrain. Too many of these drives just run out. So the football will be at the 25-yard line as this offense gets set to take right, over. here this afternoon and that last carry it puts him over 100 yards now for the day they stay on the ground but this time it's Elliott and he'll get it out near the 40 to the 39 for just four yards on the pickup but that's good enough to extend the drive third quarter and you've got the lead you're not ready to go into that four minute offense to close the game out but a running game can really benefit your team right now so the run moves the chains and here we go on first down Yard line. A solid run on first down. Gain of seven leaves it with a second and three. You know how we get focused at end of the half and end of the game situations about how much time's on the board and you know what you need to do. Sometimes you don't even have to worry about that. That's just smart football. You know that kind of a lead, standing bounds, it burns clock even in a situation that we're not really focused on. And he'll be brought down at the 48-yard line. That's a pickup of six and good enough to move the chains. So many teams want to throw the ball in this situation nowadays, but I love watching a team that has enough confidence to go ahead and run the football in that situation. It's almost a tendency breaker. Lining up first and ten. Strong left, strong left. Alright, here we go. Look at this, a tight end carry. And he gets this inside the 35-yard line. Now whistles come in. We're gonna get a timeout here by the offense. It's just their first, so two remaining as they burn one here in this third quarter. So the offense takes the timeout, and they are back out and ready to rock.
The Cowboys on third down. Not quite 50%. Four for nine. This will be third and 15. Here we go now. They're going to go with a tight end here on the running play. And he'll work his way forward up to the 22. Two yards on the pick up there. It's fourth down. Now, now comes the Cowboys punter as he'll punt it away for the fourth time today. His first punt, 45 yards. This looks good as well. Now here's Janice. So a change of possession here on the punt. And the offense will take over with a new set of downs. So the football will be at the 25-yard line as this offense gets set to take over. So out come the Cowboys now as their offense gets set to take over. And on the last go around, they really couldn't get anything going. They had to punt from deep inside their own territory, which means you're going to lose the field position battle as a general rule. What they're looking for now is a little more consistency, move the ball at least a few times on offense, get a couple of first downs, and hopefully flip the field. Yeah, just something to build off of. That's what they're looking for here. Incomplete. Call it no gain on the keeper, and it's going to bring up a third down. And one of the things that makes this play so difficult to defend is that it has so many options to it, and the quarterback has to go through them and fast. Do you hand it off inside? Do you keep it yourself? Do you pitch it to a trailing back? On this play, it's hard to say that you made the right decision because that play was swallowed up for no gain. It's a gain of five, but it'll lead to a fourth down. And there's a run to be happy with. Good, solid yardage. You'll take that any time you hand the ball to a back. And he deserves a bronze leg as he gets this one away. And this will be taken at the 13. Job on the return there, 16 yards. And out will come the offense as they take over. Well, their defense did the job. They got the turnover on downs. Now what can the offense do as they take possession? And out now come the Cowboys. They were out in front the last time they had to punt it away. We'll see if they can add to their lead now. They don't want to go out and, and punt it away again. This team now wants to get a cushion. and you'd say this is kind of the key here. Grind out some yardage, work on that clock, see if you can continue to tick it down. Definitely, you want to leave things out at this point, right? Continue to possess the football. Gain some yardage and put the onus on the defense. Do they have to use timeouts? What are they going to do to stop you? You take a charge. Really nice pickup of 14 yards, and it moves the sticks. He attacks the football in the air. It's always surprising to me when he doesn't complete a pass like that. Steps away. He was hit, and he lost the football. Now, plays like this when the ball comes free, it's often unusual for the team that lost it to get it back because this is, this is the quarterback. The ball gets away from him. Everyone else is trying to execute what they're supposed to do on offense. They're usually looking in the other direction, downfield, or have moved away from it. In this case, though, a teammate is able to come up with the ball. It looks like the Packers have added an extra DB on third down. Here we go. A 20th carry here for set to take over. The offense for the Cowboys now working their way back onto the field. They start on the ground with Elliott. And last time, obviously not what you're looking for. You've got the lead. 
you get to protect the football. So in other words, someone got lucky because they've been moving the ball really well and wearing them down. In this case, though, giving up the football doesn't make them very happy. They can't wait to get back out there to atone for it. Yeah, trying to atone for it here on this drive. And the offense here just looking to stay in bounds, complete the short passes, and put this game on ice. They'll run it down to the goal. And he takes it past the 45 and down at the 46. It's a six-yard pickup, but it gets him to second and four. So the offense readies for a second and four. Time for a break. We'll come back, see what transpires after this. So the Cowboys in possession of the football here as we get you reset. They've got a second down now as they search for a way to get this one to the finish line. Four yards remaining now on second down. Ten now for the offensive group. Here we go. They'll run it now out of the gun. And he's brought down. And now we're going to get a timeout defensively. So another stop. 150 left in the football game. Looking to jam the receivers at the line here. Press coverage look defensively. They'll run it now out of the gun. And he's going to get this one down to the 30. Two yards on the carry there, and it's going to lead him to third down. And now the question everyone's wondering, look at the clock, late fourth quarter, do they put the ball in the air here on third? I don't. I run the football, and I tell my offensive line, no leakage up front. I don't want my running back hit as I hand the ball off to him. I don't want any type of an issue. But if I am going to throw, quick throw, out to the perimeter, maybe one of my best receivers, throw a quick slant or something like that. And the broken tackle helps lead to a first down game. That one goes for 13 yards, and it moves the sticks. For that last run for a first down, it really should be the last call for the defense. I don't care how many they've had in the box, they need to add more people. They'll run it now, out of the gun. And he's going to be taken down with a marker on the field. So let's see about the call. Holding offense. So a decent game, but all for not on the penalty. That's too bad, isn't it? They were feeling pretty good about it. The only people celebrating, the guys who just gave up that play. Los 
Los Angeles.